Well, hello everybody. Welcome to another wonderful day of Charlotte Wars Adventure in Factorio. And this is our Let's Learn series that we're doing. So, just for those of you, if you're curious, uh, basically I'm using, you know, was it Alpha 10.12? And my understanding is there are updates available, but for some reason this shows up as there's new, you know, new updates. So maybe I need to upload or update. Uh, you download like a new update or whatever. Well, I'll do that another time. So let's get on to playing here. Load game. Okay, load. I just wanted to show you that. Okay, so where are we? It's been a while. Uh, our family's been a little bit sick. So I just need to kind of refresh myself with what's happening here. And another, another thing I'm going to try and do is I'm going to try and keep a kind of like a I'm going to try and be mindful of, of me saying um a lot. And what we're going to do is I'm going to kind of explore over here because there's some iron I think we need to take. So let's see. Let's see how close we can get. So there's oil here. There's aliens here. So I think what we want to do, I think we can put one here. Let's put a couple. Okay. And if we go E, we should have some of these. Put some in there and put some in here. Now let's kind of start the battle. Hey, why isn't it working? There we go. That worked. Let's see if we can kill these guys here. Okay, let's do this. Okay, I need to place one of these guys. Okay. Need to run over here. Oh, come on. Okay, we need to put bullets in here. Okay. Can I grab this stuff here? They might destroy that. Which is okay. Let's pick these up. Let's put this down here. Okay, put this here. Man, this is happening way too fast. Uh, e for inventory. Okay. Let's split that in half. Put that there. And carry on with killing. Let's do this weapon. Uh, Q is it? Yeah. Okay, this will do it. So the shotgun kicks ass. There we go. There we go. There's some alien artifacts. And what's this stuff? This is stone. Hey, how do you pick this stuff up? Um, F? Uh, F. Okay. <laughs> oh, man, that was tough. Let's pick that up. Let's put that there. Let's put these bullets down here. So we took that out. Not too shabby. Let's pick this up. Okay, we're gonna kind of check up here. Uh, iron ore, here we go, here we go. So I wanna tap into this iron ore here. Meaning, I need to build a couple of these dudes. We're gonna have to put a couple of these guys here for protection. One, two, three, four. Okay. And then we need to drop some bullets into these guys. This is awesome. So this is a tiny deposit. Uh, it is far away from where we are. So I think what we want to do is I want to try and figure out how to bring this over. I need more bullets so let's kind of walk back this way. Well, that was cool. So we took out that little alien place. Um, yeah, this is a small deposit, but it's far enough away from everything. and I don't have pollution 
around my base too much yet. So I think what we'll just end up doing is bringing up our supplies. Uh, let's see here. Supplies. I might want to build a train if I can. I don't know if I have the technology for that. I'm going to have to double check on that. Okay, so let's take a look at our base a bit. I need some bullets. We'll have to keep an eye on those turrets up there. If it starts beeping a lot, then we'll have to do something about it. Okay, so we got more bullets there. I need more shotgun shells. So. Okay, perfect. So back to this. I apologize for that. Uh, I just had to step away from the computer. So this is research, so it looks like we have a backlog on the green. Um, bullet shooting speed, okay. I need to build shotgun shells, so what do I need for that? Iron plates and copper plates. So here's iron plates, which goes up to here. And we got copper plates here. So let's place this thing. Let's build an automation thing. Where are we? Assembly machine, I think that will do up to two ingredients. Okay. What do we need? I need more iron. Do I have a box for iron? Yes, I do. This is kind of like my siphon that I have. So that way if I need stuff, I can take from it. And it looks like we made this. So I'm going to position this right here, I think. And then we need a couple of these yellow guys. These inserters, I think I'm even making inserters somewhere. Belts. Oh, right here, right here. And where are these going? These inserters are going directly into the green. So if I take it from here... I'm just trying to think if I can siphon from this. And I think I can do that like this. If I was to put a box down. So if you put a box like that, put one of these, uh, pick that up, put that there, put this like that, and then we need to make sure that we only have enough for those. Okay, perfect. So this is going to be making them like crazy. Uh, they'll be making them probably both ways. So this will fill up. Perfect. That uh, looks good. It's using gears. Okay. So now, let's deal with this. So if, so since I want to make shotgun shells, I'm going to put those both there. Put another power pole. Yeah, add to this big mess. <laughs> uh, put that there. And put that there do this so we, we have a limit and then we're gonna pick those bang looks like that is operating so now we got shotgun shells in the works which is wonderful so what are we gonna do next I'm thinking I'm thinking here so I got circuits that we're making I've got this stuff this is all just a big jumble so if I look at technologies we're doing the bullet speed so I think what we'll do Advanced Electronics opens up all of this stuff, which means then it, it leads into these other aspects of the game. Logistics too, this is faster belts, which will allow the railway and automobilism. So this will be next to research, I think. And advanced material processing, what's this? Steel furnace. Huh. Yeah, I'm not sure what any of this stuff does. I know that it basically unlocks other technologies. I'll research this as well since we want the extra hotbar down below. Yeah, so all this stuff really is, is useful. Inserter stack arm size, oil processing, military to require steel processing, piercing rounds, basic grenade. Oh, that'd be cool against the, the aliens. So yeah. So, what time is it here? Let me double check the time. I think it's been about 20 minutes. 
So we've got about 10 minutes more. So my plan for, uh, for the next stage of this part of the game is to, to grab power from up above. Uh, so let's make some more power poles. And basically I want to bring power. Let's see if we can do this up here, here. I want to keep building this basically in this direction. So I want to bring power. Let's see here. I want to bring power to where I put those those other iron mine things because we want to bring the iron down to here or down to where our main base is here. So let's chop these trees down. Okay. Okay, put that there. I'll chop this tree down. Make a little path. I'm gonna need these trees anyways for more power poles. So let's just say it's perfect. Put that there. Uh, let's see. Chop this down. Chop this down. Put that there. Chop this down. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see, and I'm still kind of coughing. I still kind of have my voice that's been affected uh, from being s sick. I guess on Christmas break, uh, the kids got sick, and I'm saying, uh, again, oh well. And so from that, we've been kind of recovering out of that. So let's see, where are we here? Where is this iron? Uh, is this it here? I think this is it here. Oh, here we go, up here. This is it. Did we build any of those guys? Yeah, we did. Just two here. So hopefully we can cover this. Oh, no, we can't cover it all. So let's see here. Maybe we'll put it like this. Like this. Yeah, okay, that looks good. Build a couple more while we wait for that to craft. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm digging this game. I just know that you know, you're probably going to find me moving a lot slower now in this part of the game just because we're waiting on the research to kind of kick in and, and all of that other razzmatazz. So let's put that there and let's put that there. And then we're going to put power lines in place here. Put one there, one there, and then we'll have to bring down the power like this. Chop that down. Bring power, power. Okay, I'm just trying to make sure I reconnect with the two ends of the power. Oh, there we go. So let's carry this on. And I think we're going to finish, ooh, yeah, there we go, now I can build more power poles. Let's build a bunch of these. Yeah, so I think that's it. I think I'm going to call it here, since we're almost done. Uh, let's continue with this. I hope you're enjoying the series. It's just basically about me derping around, trying to figure this game out, trying to you gain some experience with it because the only time I play this is with all of you all of you watching so I appreciate you watching I appreciate the new subscribers to the channel so if you're actually watching this video hey right on thank you for for your patronage thank you for deciding to subscribe and to choose you know, me as your your method of entertainment <laughs> whether it be on a daily basis or whether it be once in a while that all does not matter as long as you're you're having a good time and you're you're you feel I'm wondering why I don't have power so if I right click on this the left click so it's not connected I guess I don't have it connected shoot <laughs> oh well so yeah so as long as you're having fun and you know this is enjoyable for you it's gonna remain enjoyable for me to play um, I'm looking forward for this game to come out on Steam. I know that there's talk about that from reading on the forums and other you know, methods of communication. 
Oh yeah, it's not connected here. I, f I should have figured that. And so, yeah, so let's take a look at the power now. Left click. Yeah, okay, it looks like we're doing good on the production. Perfect. So that means those guys kicked in. Uh, maybe I'll bring a belt all the way down to here. So let's make a bunch of belts here. Maybe I'll just kind of tie it into the system here. And it'll be in this part here. So, let's see. Ah, it's not working. Let's pick that up. So anyways, thank you for watching everybody. I hope you've enjoyed this episode. And I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.